Hello, brothers and sisters. This is Lisa, and I'm here to share a repost from Glinda Lomax. The title is, As You Have Sown, So Shall You Now Reap. And this was originally posted January 28th, 2011. As you have sown, so shall you now reap, my children. Be careful that the words you speak and the ways in which you have dealt with others is fair and reputable, for I shall now begin repaying all that you have done, both good and bad. If you have done evil, repent. If you have done well, then I shall reward you with good. For too long have my children frolicked in the ways of this world, instead of keeping their eyes on me. Many of you care more for prospering your own reputation than you do mine, and you shall be found as clouds with no rain for your efforts. For I cannot bless what is not of me. For those of you who have turned from me to the world, know that your day of judgment is at hand, and all you have done is soon to come back upon your own heads. Your hands are not clean, and your hearts have not been purified in the fires of my refining, for you chose not to stay where I placed you, but ran after your own ways. Woe to you who plan your own footsteps and follow your own plans in days to come, for you shall not know where to run as my judgments begins to fall in your lives. Woe to you who call upon and trust in other gods, for they can neither save nor deliver you from what is coming. Woe to you, inhabitants of the earth, for Satan has come down to you with great wrath, and the end is near. Woe to you who prophesy lies and lead my children astray, for you yourselves shall also be deceived. As you have sown, so shall you reap. Thus saith the Lord of hosts. This year shall be a time of reaping what has been sown, both in the natural and the spiritual. If you have sown strife, you shall now reap the same. If you have sown deception, you shall reap it. But if you have sown love and obedience, you shall now reap the rewards of my kingdom. Be careful that you do not deceive yourselves, my children, for many of you think you stand when you are deceived. Bring your hearts before me as an offering, and I will cleanse them with my refining fire, for I shall burn everything out that is not of me. For you look at others as through a magnifying glass, but examine yourselves by other standards. An unjust weight is an abomination in my sight. Check your hearts, my children. Check your hearts that you may be found fit for my use in kingdom work. For many of you think you are working for me, but you carry out the work of the enemy of your souls. Remove from your lives what is not of me, and all that is not pure and holy like me. Cleanse your hands that I may use them for kingdom work. Do not come before me any longer with the sins of the world staining your hands, but walk before me clean, pure, and holy. Why look you to your own things? Turn your eyes to your brother in need. Turn your heart to the lost and broken in the world of sin in which you live. And that is the end of this message. I pray you all have a beautiful day in the Lord. God bless each and every one of you. And I will see you either next video or in the air. Bye-bye.